Welcome to today's episode. We have an exciting topic to dive into, the SMART framework for improving reasoning tasks in language models. Joining us is Dr. Emily Carter, an expert in AI and machine learning. Emily, thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. I'm thrilled to discuss this fascinating development. Let's start simple. Why do language models struggle with multi-step reasoning tasks? Great question. Language models, or LMs, are fantastic at processing language, but often stumble when it comes to applying the right strategies for complex reasoning. Think of it like trying to solve a puzzle without knowing the best approach. They usually need multiple attempts to get it right, which can be quite resource intensive. So what exactly is SMART and how does it help? SMART stands for Self-Learning Meta Strategy Agent for Reasoning Tasks. It's a framework that empowers LMs to autonomously learn and select effective strategies for reasoning tasks. Imagine teaching a student not just to solve a problem, but to choose the best method from the get-go. SMART does this by modeling strategy selection as a Markov decision process, or MDP, and uses reinforcement learning to continuously refine its approach. That sounds intriguing. Can you explain how this process works? Certainly. In SMART, we treat strategy selection like a decision-making game. The LM is the player, and each strategy it chooses is a move in the game. With reinforcement learning, the LM receives feedback on its choices, allowing it to learn which strategies work best. Over time, it gets better at picking the optimal strategy right away, much like a chess player learning to make the best opening moves. What are the main challenges in implementing SMART? One major challenge is ensuring that LMs can select the correct strategy without external feedback. It's like asking someone to learn from their own mistakes without a teacher's guidance. Another challenge is balancing exploration, trying new strategies, and exploitation using known successful strategies. It's a delicate dance to ensure the model doesn't get stuck in a rut or miss out on better options. How does SMART overcome these limitations? SMART cleverly internalizes the learning process. It updates its data set with successful strategies, creating a bias towards choosing the right path early on. It's akin to a student who not only learns from their mistakes, but also keeps a journal of what worked best, refining their approach with each new problem. What are some broader implications of this framework? The implications are quite exciting. By reducing the need for costly iterative refinement, SMART makes LMs more efficient. This means faster and more accurate outputs, which is crucial for applications like customer service or real-time data analysis. Plus, it showcases the potential for LMs to autonomously enhance their reasoning capabilities, opening doors to more advanced AI applications. Can you share some results from experiments with SMART? Absolutely. In experiments on datasets like GSM-8K and SVAMP, SMART outperformed traditional methods, achieving higher accuracy with fewer inference passes. It's like a student acing a test on the first try instead of needing multiple attempts to get it right. This efficiency is a game changer for deploying LMs in real-world scenarios. That's impressive. So what's next for SMART? The future is bright. We're looking at expanding SMART's capabilities to even more complex reasoning tasks and exploring its integration with other AI systems. The goal is to create LMs that are not just reactive, but proactive in their problem-solving approach, continually learning and adapting to new challenges. Thanks, Emily, for such an insightful conversation. It's fascinating to see how SMART is pushing the boundaries of what language models can achieve. Thank you. It's been a pleasure sharing this journey with you and your listeners.